Hello everyone, okay today I'm going to make an unboxing of the GoMax smartphone. So I've been searching through the website, official website and bought this one. So this is the box here, as yes, you can see it's GoMax, um, I don't know, G1C. So this is the box itself. Um, it's, I, it's, it looks like premium or something but I think it's it's fine. Okay, so let's open the box. Okay, first, um, okay, so it it kind of got have a pages things like that. Because you can see it's a global club. This is the concept design. Okay, nothing more. Okay, so here the it shows the features for the smartphone. So this is GoMax Swift L1. 4G LTE so you can see here it's 4G LTE band dual sim yes 5 inches um, 8 megapixel uh, rear camera the back camera and 2 megapixel front camera for a selfie it runs on Android Lollipop uh, MTK chipset so 1 gigabyte RAM 8 gigabyte ROM internal is 8 gigabyte so micro SD up to 32 gigabyte okay so this is the smartphone Okay, let's pull it up. So, what's in the box? So, okay. What else in the box here? So, it, sh it shows something like that. I think it's a charger. Let's pull it up. So, there you go. Um, what's inside this thing? Okay, so this is the USB, uh, normal Android USB port, as you can see there. Um, the headphone, and what do we have here? Pull it up. Yes, the, the adapter. It's, it's Asian type adapter, so yeah. So put it aside. Um, now, what's inside there? Oh, yeah. It... It have a battery here. I don't know if it is a spare battery or didn't know about that. Uh, so this is the TPU case. It comes along with this. Oh, wow, that's cool. And this instruction manual, the screen protector. Maybe we should use the tempered glass instead. Instruction manual there. Okay, and this is the warranty card. Okay, so I think that's it. Okay, so um, let's let's unpack this smartphone. Put it aside. Unpack this smartphone. Okay, put it in the box like this. Okay, let's see. So um, maybe I think I, sh I should I should open this one. So it's quad core um, processor, 1.3 gigahertz. So, I think you got no issue with the performance, so we need to test it out. So let's, let's remove the screen first. There you go. So you can see it for yourself, the, the, the design of the smartphone. So let's turn it on. I, I don't know. Um, let's pop this open first. Okay, so once you have pop it back open, so okay, there is no battery, so we need to use this battery. I thought it was a spare part, but it's okay. So um, put it in here. So this there is a dual SIM, SIM dual SIM slot, SIM one and SIM two, and this one is for SD card. So put it inside here. Snugly. Okay, there you go. So, put it back. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, okay, everything is clear. So, right now, let's turn it on. Yeah, there 
go. It will show you that Android is starting for the first time. Okay, so here it is. It kind of looks looks like iPhone because still of the wallpaper. Okay, let's slide it open. Okay. okay next. Okay, so there. Are, okay, no features like iPhone. It's just like that. Just the lock screen uh, wallpaper. Wait a minute. Okay. Oh, just like that. Uh, I have to get used to it. Okay, so uh, here it says that the internal RAM is one gigabyte. So let's see. Let's check it for myself. I have to check it. Okay, let's go on to settings. And let's find the apps. Yeah, there you go. Okay, go on to all. Wait, it, it should show. Oh, yes, there you go. So the RAM is 94. Um, what, what can I say? This is. Apps system free, so we total up. Yes, it's one gigabyte RAM. Okay, that's good. So let's go on to storage. Mm -hmm. There you go. Storage. Okay, so the total space is eight gigabyte, but occupied by the internal um, ROM itself is. 4 gigabyte so you get another 4 gigabyte available it's okay you can extend it by using external SD card so okay so let's see about phone hmm model name is Q5005 and version 5.1 which runs on Android Lollipop there you go change the color okay let's go back mm-hmm Okay, so let's go and check the camera quality. We are going to check that. So let's go on and find the camera. There you go. Okay, it says that here is eight gigabyte rear camera. Oops, it's 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 okay. So I think I think I try to shut it. How how can I capture this? Okay. Why? Um, okay, here the shutter. The shutter is on top of the screen. Okay, so let's turn on the flash. It shouldn't be turned on. Okay, let's take it again. Okay, let's look at the quality. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's it's eight megapixel um camera. So front cam front cam front cam uh, I think let's let's check it out. Okay, so uh, I don't wanna show myself. Arrgh. Let's let's take the Okay, front cam. Let's see the quality. Okay, it's two megapixel. I think that's quite good. So, um, okay, for the performance, I need to test it out. Uh, I think the one point three gigahertz for quad core is the same as all MTK chipset. I think that's there will be no much difference between that so um 
the other features I think that's it, it it's it got a flash back here uh, camera lens um, speaker at the back okay the rest um, I think that's it so if you enjoy watching this video please like share and subscribe